example, we have two big cubes. Each of them represents 1,000, so we have two thousands. We have one flat, which is 100. We have two longs. Each of them has a value of 10, so we have two tens, or 20. And we have one small cube, which represents one. Remember that each time we move to the left, the place value is getting 10 times greater. So thousands are 10 times greater than hundreds, hundreds are 10 times greater than tens, tens are 10 times greater than ones. So again, I'm going to start by showing you the first representation, which is the picture that we have here. We have two in the thousands place, one in the hundreds, two in the tens, and one in the ones. So again, we have 2,121. <clears throat> We can regroup in order to represent 2,121 in a different way. I'm going to start by regrouping one of the thousands. When I regroup 1,000, I can turn it into 10 hundreds. So 1,000 is the same thing as saying 10 hundreds. And we can show that here. So now we only have one in the thousands place, and that's because we regrouped the other one into the hundreds. So 100, 200s, 300s, 400s, 500s, 600s, 700s, 800s, 900s, 1000s. Plus the 100 that was already in the hundreds place. So this is a second way to represent 2100. 21. We could also, if we want, represent it in another way and regroup this thousand into ten hundreds as well. So now we don't have any large cubes for the thousands place, but that's because I uh, regrouped both of them into the hundreds. We can also regroup hundreds into tens. So I just took 100 and I regrouped it into 10 tens. So now we have one ten, two tens, three tens, four tens, five tens, six tens, seven tens, eight tens, nine tens, ten tens, which is the same thing as 100. Plus, we have the two tens that were already in the tens place value. So this, again, is another way that we could represent 2,121. It still has a value of 2,121. It is just not broken down in the place values that we have represented in the standard form. Finally, I'll show one more way. However, there are many more ways that we can regroup these uh, base 10 blocks here. But I'm going to regroup one of the tens into 10 ones. I took one of the tens and I regrouped it into 10 ones. So the 10 is still there, but it's no longer in the tens place value. It's now in the ones place value as 10 ones plus the one that we already had in the ones place.